What up, in this Josh, your boy IBS Kelso coming back with another MX Box banger. We're here on a snow cross map that just came out on MXB Mods. It's called just round one of a championship. I believe it's just snow cross. I don't think there's really a name to it, but it's uh, created by Pro, yeah, Proc Works, P R O C. And uh, I gotta say, man, it's actually a dub. I haven't really spun any laps though, but um, we don't really get anything like this. It's kind of like a new series, and I guess a, another avenue of approach for us to all ride. Um, I'm sorry I don't do much, real quick, I guess, disclaimer, I'm sorry I don't do much, uh, I guess, track reviews. It's not a huge track review guy, um, but tonight when I was streaming, kind of baked, opened up my eyes just a bit and kind of told me, hey man, like, I know you don't like doing track reviews, but like, I know that if when I make something, I don't matter, it doesn't matter how many people I see make it, it's always a new light, I always like to see everybody's perspective to it. And I started realizing at that point, it's just like, man, maybe I'm just let, you know, kind of not giving enough to the community to like hey like your track was a dub i'm sorry it's just like i'm more of a race guy i'd rather show your track off in a race than just doing here and running my own laps and yapping i mean you guys already call me the yap king but doesn't everybody yap when you start making a freaking <laughs> i don't know when you start making a track review but i mean at the end of the day grain of, you know grain of salt i'm gonna start doing some more track reviews i'm gonna try to at least and just see it because kind of hit me and realized that yeah you know that's a respect level i get it like especially when you have something come out and you want to be praised for it not necessarily you just want to see like and what are people liking it are people loving it and i guess i'll get start giving my humble opinion to it so w man i only do it for certain people but i think i'll start looking around but with that being said so far man uh proc uh proc it's pretty nice man this is a w track so far i'm gonna start trying to take some more lines I'm very excited to see where this championship goes. He did say there's 16 available gates that actually do work. So maybe we can get some racing in here if it can be up on the daddy list. Now, that's another thing where a lot of track creators don't know how to put their stuff on the daddy. Um, so hopefully that has been taken care of. But I, I feel like it's not too hard of a process. But if it is, hopefully you can reach into somebody. But track's not too long. And I'm sorry that this thing sounds like a whining little like a mouse, church mouse or something, man. But... Yeah, man, I mean, I've been enjoying it. I haven't really done too much snowcross stuff. Oh, I probably could have took that inside. I want to see what this other side over here, but I haven't done too much content on it myself, but I thought it was fun to at least get, dip my feet in before I went into, uh, I went to a little bit of a recession of going on vacation, so now it's something over here to where it's like a backside. I think it's over here. Oh, so, yeah, I went on vacation, saw these came out. I barely touched into them. Oh, this actually ain't bad. Oh, that's not a bad little spot. So there's two little lines that you can do. Pretty nice. But the snow cross actually is, um, they handle pretty well. Like, I think, like, the bumps are pretty crazy. You might have to figure out suspension if you can. Um, I haven't really touched. I'm kind of just running bone stock other than, like, shifting down one of the uh, sprockets to get a little bit more speed. Maybe I can get that triple here, too. But, hey, the atmosphere is great. I think this is our first official, I'm not mistaken, our first official snow cross. Like, I know we have snowy tracks, but this is, like, I feel like my first official. And I could be wrong, but since, like, I was on vacation and the hackers, like, low-key, like, hacked into MXB mods and took the site down, I've kind of been, like, disconnected inside of the mods page and, like, haven't really been seeing much tracks come out because I just haven't been wanting to get on the site. Um... So I guess it's like L me, but really not. It's just like, man, like, we, 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 we were told that, you know, protection was there. The protection's not there. So now we got to re-all build up. But I'm happy that now we kind of had this happen so we can see their awakening, like their, their root awakening for us. We need to upgrade our MXB mods. But, Brock, I got to say, man, for this Snowcraft stuff, it's really cool, man. I think that's why I started doing the Supermoto stuff lately is this. It's just a different avenue of approach. I mean, you got the bike life. I mean, Endo's. And Enduro's barely there, so you got Supercross, Motocross, MXGP, and then Bike Life, right? We're not really seeing too much from Supermoto. Now you're adding Snowcross into it, which I think is going to be a dub, man. I mean, I would love to have some races. I mean, this looks fun. I really want to see how the mechanics do when you're, like, on a race with 16 other people to where it's like, can these bikes handle getting collided with Pavobo Cheese or, you know, stuff like that. But sorry I don't have Max HUD on either. I don't really know what my laps are. Kind of just cruising for a bruising right now. But I don't really look around the track. I guess we can just see around the environment. I mean, I love the aspect of like the trees kind of like half. But yeah, like it's a little bit of like a snow out. So it's not fully iced down. Got the bulldozers out here. Oh, that thing's got collisions. It's going to crash my game. It's going to crash my game. It's going to crash my game. Ooh, hoo, hoo. That almost crashed my game. Yep. 
What the chicken bone? Did you hear the did you hear the thing just start screaming at me, bro? Alright, noted. Do not go to the bulldozers, bro. <laughs> that was pretty wild. That was sicko mode. But with that being said, I guess we'll get back on the track. <laughs> Guess we're not gonna explore too much, but it's got a nice little, um, man, like almost like you're going up to Big Bear or something like that. You're kind of like at a ski resort. That's pretty nice, man. It's not too, like, super realistic, and I don't know if this is his first track, but I know it's the first snow cross track I've seen from Proc. I don't think I've seen any tracks from Proc at all, so if he's just doing the straight snow series, that's gonna be really cool. Super excited to see more, and this is round one of a championship, so maybe we can host our own little, you know, fun little series in these tracks. Let me take this inside. Oh man. Maybe we can host a fun little spot in our own little series, or our own little tracks, because maybe he's coming out with his own little stuff, and I'd be proudly to support it. This is really sick. I mean, look how, I think playing in third person is kind of better than first person. I think it's a little bit, a little bit easier on the eyes, right? I mean... You're really not seeing too much from the front fender when you're doing it in first, so I guess I'll play a little bit in out, you know, third person. If not, I'll probably stay here. It just looks a little bit better, to be honest. Looks a little bit better. I mean, if I was to ride snow cross now, I would probably do it in third person just because, like, you get to see that you're actually on a snow cross. And especially when, like, somebody that's new to the game or doesn't know what's going on, they're like, I don't even know what you're on, bro. I just hear you screaming at me. So maybe this could definitely help. Dang. I don't know where, like, the wheels are, bro. I got to figure that out. But, yeah, that's something for, like, if, like, an outsider perspective, you're like, dude, I don't even know what you're riding, bro, so. Maybe I'll just stick to the, uh, third person. But, Proc, hopefully you drop a second one pretty soon. Hopefully these aren't too hard to handle, but the textures are feeling pretty great. Um, I don't know how the E-Road's gonna drop down. I wonder if E-Road's even a thing on Snowcross. Like, how deep can you go? Can you make it to grass? You know, that'd be pretty wild. I mean, I know it's a video game, but... Or, or is this, like, all slick snow to where it's, like, you, you got enough under you, like, it's packed down, you know? Kind of screaming on the outdoors. I mean, it looks nice. I mean, I haven't really checked it. Wow, he's actually got fans out there. That's actually pretty sick, too. Oh, my God. I almost backflipped right there. He's cooking, dude. Cooking with the sauce, for sure. Definitely want to know more about that series, though, man. This would be really sick. I mean, only 16 gates. I don't know if Snowcross is supposed to be, like, huge. About 24 people riding, or if that's too dangerous. And it's supposed to be smaller, but... Go oh, inside. But it's not too long of a track either. So, like, your first, first track, it's not long. I mean, I would... I wonder if this is, like, a track IRL to where you can ride motocross during the summer and you can ride snowcross during the during the winter. That would be really sick, too. I wonder how, like, this track would, would work without snow. Or, like, if you were to come on, like, a dirt bike or something like that. But I don't think I'm going to try it. I think I'm going to just stick with the natural snowcross. But, like, the, I mean, the... Snowcross feels great. I'm super excited for what he has to come with it all. And, man, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I've got to, dude, I, I would say, like, these, these, like, things are not my forte at all, like, doing track reviews, bro. I promise you. I feel like I run out of things or I repeat things too much. But, what if I e -limb? Now, since we have this, there we go. That's what I can talk about. Since we have these tracks now, or this track, I wonder if... You know, if we can get this updated to MXB servers, that's another thing. So, it's not about it's not about getting the track updated. It's about getting these these snowmobiles updated to MXB servers. So that would go against like Nico and stuff like that. Actually, updating the servers which MXB server like runs through, and at having the snowcross because I know that he doesn't he hasn't updated the new supermotos yet. Um, he hasn't updated the new supermoto uh, update. To the to the MXB servers yet, so that's something that still needs to be worked on. I know that's something that we have to use Resolute Kraken for in order for us to get into races and stuff. And certain people can't even get into Resolute Kraken because it gives you connection timeout. So I wonder if Nico, if Nico like literally adds these snow crosses now to the MXB servers, I might like try to tell him like, hey man, can we get that update on the Supermoto too, or is just like a pick and choose, you know? So. I hope I hope we can get it all there. That way we can have multiple avenues avenues of approach. Um, it's great to just branch out and see the community grow and have their own little niche. Um, I really wonder if like four wheelers would ever come into play. I mean, that would be really cool if we can get a four wheeler mod actually working and not just broken to where it's like, oh, we're just playing a four wheeler, but like actually make it work. That'd be awesome, man. I mean, there's a lot of mods in here, and it's just about actually being able to get them to work. Ooh. Oh wait, let's whip that, John. 
guess I can focus up now on like trying to actually run some heaters maybe I don't know here we go over the top hug tight I already feel like a champion I'm not gonna lie oh man a lot oh wait no I'm good I wonder how like I'm scared of like how much like that's the bouncing the bouncing is a little iffy I feel like I don't know if you really can mess with the spring and like stop the bouncing I don't even know yeah I think it has shocks on it so maybe the bouncing could be a little different the suspension and then kind of just the breaking I the breaking is super super sensitive and might just be my own thing but we'll have to figure that out later I kind of just want to fly it through but and I, I gotta say dude for I don't know if this like I said I don't know if this is your first track but it looks amazing it's a it's a top tier thing and I wonder if like there's already now nah, there's probably no servers up because of what I just said that would be tight oh over the handlebars <laughs> I guess we can uh go explore a little bit wonder how far you can go without like falling off the map never that's the map no that's the map <laughs> that was the map chat it's over here that was just a whole bunch of people yeah I mean I don't I'm not huge for exploring I don't think there's much to explore here it's just kind of like a first hey first track here you go let's get our feet wet maybe maybe later I'm missing some Easter eggs maybe I challenge you guys to find some Easter eggs come back to me and be like hey bro you missed this you know but I don't know Oh man. Come on, push it up, push it up, push it up, push it up. There we go. Yeah, L me for not having max HUD. I really wanted to see like what my times are and if there's like a world record. Actually I might be able to do that. Be like, oh I set the world record <laughs> or something. I don't know. Here we go. Ooh! Snowcross definitely is fun though. I, I would say like I don't know too much about Snowcross IRL. Guess I should have done my homework, but I don't know too much about Snowcross at all, so maybe like Snowcross is super huge all around the world and I'm just missing out, but I mean for them to want to bring it into MX bikes and something new, I hey, all power to you, bro. I like that. I mean texture texturing and I feel like the track is fine, man. Oh, can I get that triple? Ah, oh, dude, I'm getting too active. A lot of power, a lot of torque on this thing. All right, that's the finish line. Let's go for it. Almost went over the handlebars. Nice and tight, hug tight, hug tight. Boom, jump over. There we go, easy peasy. Ah, oh, dang it. That's cuts, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh kind of went off to the right and I went left completely and I, I keep going I keep going right and it's when I need to be going left <laughs> like come on man what a L movement oh my god now I can't even get up on the plane come out or the snow cross snowmobile and I wonder what you guys think about it. let me know down in the comment section if this is something you guys really are excited for if this is just like another niche or like eh, this is gonna be dying soon I, that, that, that's a real question like do you think this is like here to stay or like is this just like the next hot topic I should say and I'm like that's like no offense to anybody that's created the snow cross but I've known like I've known like so much things to pop out and, and get super crazy and then just it dies off for no reason which I, I kind of hate man so I think if the love still shows this thing can actually be active I think we can actually get pretty crazy. Man, I gotta be careful, bro. You can literally end us so quick. You gotta lean back more than you gotta lean forward. So that's something I need to work on. All right, go right. Go right, there we go. Take all this outside. And then go left. There we go, chat. Oh. No! Bro, why do I keep messing up in a new spot, bro? <laughs> I keep messing up in a new spot. Come on, huh? I don't know, man. I feel like the track is... I feel like for how long I've been going for, the track is definitely too small for it to be a super 30-minute video. I think it's just me ranting at this point, but... I think, personally, this is definitely a good 10-minute video to 15. You know, kind of just show off the track. I would love if this was a race, you know? Unfortunately, it's not, but I would love that if this was a race video. Um... Man, it's just I can't get it right now, you know, but 
If I could get this as a race video, like showing off this track, I think it would have been a little bit more exciting. You guys probably could have seen how it really ran with other people. So maybe tomorrow I could try to entice some people if we can actually get a race for it. I would love to have some races on this and maybe get a video for it. That'd be sicko mode. So yeah, I mean, this is going to be the end of the video for me, man. Thank you guys so much for the support. I do appreciate it. Definitely give this track a go. It will be linked down in the description below. Uh, Proc, you did great on this track, bro. So let's keep grinding and uh, hopefully round two come out soon. I'd love to do some more track reviews. What is that? Is, it, is something wrong with this real quick? What the heck? Why, why, why am I getting beat up right here? Am I like going up sideways on it? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. But other than that, I'll catch you guys all in the next one. It's your boy IBS Kelso. Pup, 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 pup. Hey. Bye.